So let's go ahead and fire. Oh my. Oh my goodness, it's gone. What in the world? Hello everyone and welcome back to Stormworks. Today we're going to be taking a very short look at all the uh, at a singular weapon, the auto cannon. And now I was playing with around with this and I wasn't planning on making a video, but I decided why not? Let's go ahead and check this thing out. So, uh it is um it is amazing. I I'm going to say they have done very very well on this. <laughs> and so what we're going to do in this short little video here is we're going to be shooting my VTOL with this autocannon. We're going to see how it does. But I, I am very excited. This is, good. this is going to be fun. All right. Uh, I'm just going to show you guys what it, what it does real quick here. Let us let me just... Oh! <laughs> oh my goodness. It is amazing. So, I, some of you may be wondering how you do this, how, how you actually get it done, and I'll show you right here real quick. So, to set up a cannon or anything like that, first you want to have your actual turret here. Now, this is a rotary turret. If I type in rotary here, you will see we have the rotary auto cannon. There's all kinds of different auto cannons. We even have barrel extensions for this if I wanted to. It's pretty amazing. So as for cannons here, we've got we've got a different we got we've got quite a lot. We got artillery cannons, heavy auto cannons, barrel extension, light auto cannons, rotary auto cannons, like I'm using right now to sh for this video. Battle cannons. I'm not exactly sure how that's supposed to work, but I'm just scratching the top of this DLC, and oh my, is it amazing! So what I'm going to teach you guys how to actually set this up. So the first thing you want to do is, depending on your build, uh, you may need a belt. And what these belts are going to do is um, they're, they're going to be loading in the ammo for your auto cannon. So if you see how this is blue, what I figured is you put the blue of the belt feeder into the auto cannon, and then you go ahead and look up ammo, and you can get a auto cannon ammo, ammo drum, I uh, that just like that. And then you want to go ahead and click your ammo drum, set it to a rotary cannon. Or the cannon you're going for, so heavy, rotary, or light. I'm rotary right now. And then you can do kinetic, which is basically just a ballistic bullet. High explosive, bullets that explode. Fragmentation, bullets that split into different pieces. And then armor piercing and incendiary. Incendiary has a chance to catch fire on a vehicle. And armor piercing goes straight through and does a lot of damage. So it's good for sinking boats and stuff like that. Now, how do you actually get it to work? Well, first, you need a trigger, which you can connect up to your pilot seat's trigger or a button. It doesn't really matter. I prefer to have it be on my space button trigger so that when I'm flying or doing anything like that, I can just go ahead and trigger it and it will fire. Here, you can have an indicator to tell you if the gun is loaded. And then after that, uh, that's pretty much it. All you really need is a power source a off and on and rotation targets so pivots and stuff like that to keep it under control and oh boy it's gonna be okay let, let's just spawn this thing in and I'll show you that it works we've got our ammo drum right here there's 50 or 100 bullets I think in this one thing so let's go ahead and fire oh my oh my goodness it's gone what in the world? Um. Uh, okay. Let's turn that off. That just got flung, but look at the damage to my VTOL here. Of course, it's still going to work, but look at the damage. I don't know how far. Okay, it came in pretty decently far. It took out the co pilot seat, and up. Uh, now it's glitching out. But what just got flung was an EMP right here an EMP you push this and everything it kills everything all the electricity just stops and it's, it's basically like getting hit from a megalodon is what it does as you can see here there is no power to anything and nothing well actually turns out you can still fire it with uh, no electricity that's pretty interesting uh, it's probably a bug but you can fire it here like that and oh boy 
it it is pretty amazing granted i can't control it right now because there's no electricity to the pivots but that is the rotary auto cannon so now i'm gonna get my VTOL up in the air and we're gonna try and shoot it down all right i don't know oh oh geez Okay, well that one decided to break on me, so we're uh, in here on the other one, and we're gonna try and snipe from in here. Oh, we hit once. We got well, okay. We got the engine. We got the engine. Um, I, I think I may have uh, gotten my temperature sensor too because my uh, my automatic fire extinguisher isn't working. Did I get my temperature sensor? I don't think I did. Maybe it got disconnected. Oh, I'm going to have to fix that. <laughs> oh, no. Okay, so that was it. That's all it took. One hit. That's all it took. Wow. And it's losing power. As you can see, this stuff is amazing. So I'm, I'm just full auto this thing now. Okay, let's move it down here. No! Oh! Okay, we're hitting it maybe. I think we're hitting it. Oh, yeah, we hit it. Oh, that was amazing. Okay, let's check this thing out. Oh, look at the damage. Okay, so that's devastating. Is that an is that an enemy? Okay, no, that, that's not an enemy. But uh, right now, actually, you can check the map. And all around me, there are enemy bases being captured. So right now... This is captured by an AI. So let's teleport here and see if I can see any AIs here. Uh, oh, oh, okay. Um, I don't see enemy AI here. Oh, there's something. Is this, what is this? I have no idea what this is. I don't know if this is part of the weapon. It, it is... Oh, this is the... Okay, okay. So this is how you actually capture... Okay. Oh. So... Oh, we got enemy A... We got enemy A... Oh! Oh, this is amazing! Look at that! Man, that thing came in quick. Knew we was here and it came in quick. Okay, wow. Right, so I'm guessing at this point... All enemies have been uh, noted to my location. Got it. Okay. Oh my! Something just exploded. Okay. Oh, that's oh that's explosive ammo. Oh, this is amazing. Oh, look at this! We got to, we got another one. The spawning everywhere. Oh my goodness! Okay, this is amazing. Okay. Right. I can't have this video going on for long because it is a little bit of a short one. But wow, this is just a tiny scratch on the surface of everything in this DLC. So if you guys want to see me cover even more of this, make sure you stay tuned and hit that subscribe button. Because we will be going over all of this and it is absolutely amazing. Wow, I am impressed. For 10 bucks, I, it's definitely up there. Okay. Wow. Oh, look at that. Did you see the knockback on that helicopter when it fired the rocket? Okay, <laughs> this is cool. I will see you guys in the next one. God bless you. Alright, everyone. That was an awesome little short video, but we still have a Bible verse, even though it's a short video. So, today's Bible verse is, Do not judge others, and you will not be judged, for you will be treated as you treat others. That was Matthew 7, verse 1 and 2. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. God bless you.